Hey folks, welcome back to another daily unboxing with yours truly, Sam Healy. Today we are taking a look at New Salem, um, the second edition. It's a game by Brian Hink and Clayton uh, Skanky. Uh, the art is by Andrea Ogiati. It includes the Constable expansion, uh, so a second edition, which is pretty cool. It is by Overworld Games, and uh, looks like you are uh, gathering clues to uncover who among you are the witches and who are the Puritans. Uh, you choose different buildings, you earn points, uh, you trigger events. Uh, so we are looking at... Um, where is it? Where is the player stuff? Player count and all that. Oh, okay, here it is. Three to eight players, 30 to 60 minutes, ages 14 and up. So let's go ahead and uh, get this open and see what's on the inside. So I'm imagining there's gonna be some elevation of, of uh, components and all that since second edition. Well, maybe, maybe not. We'll see. All right, here we go. Come on, there we go. All right, so here you have a bunch of cubes that are in different bags. And of course, these are just uh, wooden cubes, white, black, there you have it. Um, here are a bunch of uh, baggies that you can use for the game. Uh, rule book, looks like. Um, so there's a components list, 35 hope cubes, 35 despair cubes, 144 building cards, 24 event cards, 5 round cards, 10 character cards. All right. So we're continuing here, how you have to seed the deck, I imagine. All right, so set up. Gameplay, you draft buildings, deal, draft, and discard, and then you draw events, initiate events, and then shuffle, and the round end, you start another one until uh, the game ends. All right, a lot of game ends, so here we go. Play ends after the initiate events phase of the fifth round. The amount of despair in the game will determine whenever the winner will be a whether the winner will be a Puritan or a witch. The winner uh, will be the player whose buildings score them the most points. All righty, so there you have it. Um, a couple of more game ends there, some rules and so forth. So let's go ahead and see about some of these cards here. All right. Don't, I don't recall what the other cards used to look like, so this is gonna be a little bit strange, but here you go, you have a gaming den, a sanctuary. Um, I do like the artwork, it's cool. Uh, cemetery. Oof. Cloud up there. Alright, so you get the idea. These different building cards that are out here. The school, black market, the infirmary, college, pawnbroker, a theater, college again, more pawnbrokers, the jail, the smithy. Um, so, I like it. It looks good. Um, I like the, uh, graphic design of the card as well. So that's pretty cool. These are your building cards. Uh, looks like more building cards in here. Um, but also some events. So let's see. All right, so we have event cards. And there are the characters. We'll go over those in just a second. And then round cards, more buildings. And so pretty sure the buildings we've already seen uh, there's a broth hole, and I didn't see that in the other one, but there you go. Okay, so those are all the building cards, and you have the character cards. So here we have Mortimer, the alchemist. Uh, we have uh, Melior M Meliora, the heiress. Amos, the merchant. Um, Agnes, the madam. Uh, Virginia, the proprietor. And then you have uh, Stuart, the playwright. Um, Jeb Jed Jebediah, the preacher. Ethel, the teacher. 
Then you have Charity, the innkeeper, and Abraham, the governor. So those are your 10 character cards. And then looks like more building cards here. And then events. So you have confessions, convictions, and and you have to basically do what's what's going on down here on the bottom of the card. Blessings, burning, cleansing, um, coercion, examination, exorcism, hysteria, interrogation, pardon, uh, pleading, premonition, purge, rebirth rebuilding ritual so there's just a bunch of different things here i really do like the uh, uh the look of the game i guess but uh, these are all just popping right out so usually we go through and tell you if this is popping out well or not but they definitely are they're literally falling out of the uh things here so that should give you a little bit of a clue uh, this is looks like it's the first player token. Insert me into the base head first. Oh, okay. Well, huh. uh, alrighty. Well, we will do that, I guess, later on. All right. So we have all of these tokens in here, and that looks like it's that looks like it for what comes in the bag uh, box. So that is New Salem, which includes the Constable Edition expansion, rather, from Overworld Games. Thanks for joining us. We certainly appreciate it. We'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Take care. Thanks so much for watching another Dice Tower video. If you enjoy our videos, subscribe to the channel for more fun, comprehensive board game coverage. Also, consider joining us at one of our events. Come to Dice Tower Retreat, a small, intimate gathering where gaming is king. Join us for Dice Tower Cruise, the largest board game cruise. Attend Dice Tower West in Las Vegas for gaming fun on the West Coast, or Dice Tower East in Orlando in sunny Florida. Dice Tower Conventions, the friendliest gaming conventions on Earth. I'm Eric Summerer, and you've been watching The Dice Tower.